ahead of some big market moving events, Wall Street was stuck in lackluster trade on Tuesday afternoon. The US Federal Reserve has now started its two-day policy meeting and more corporate results are continuing to roll in. Economic data, well, that's been mixed today. Durable goods are down for the second straight month, while home prices were shown to have risen slightly faster in August than the month before. Now let's move to the Forex market. The US dollar is on the upside. First, the Euro-US dollar pair. That's 0.17% lower at 1.1040. The pound US dollar pair is 0.42% lower at 1.5292. And the US dollar yen is 0.55% lower at 120.43. Today's Trading Central focus is on the US dollar Canadian dollar. The pair has hit a first target at 1.32 and remains on the upside. Long positions above the new support at 1.3150 are favoured with targets at 1.3250 and 1.3290 in extension. Now to precious metals, they're under pressure. For gold, a support base has formed around 1162, which should limit the downside potential. The relative strength index indicator is supported by a rising trend line and long positions above the support at 1162 with targets at 1170.20 and 1175 in extension. The price of silver is 0.03% higher at $15.91 a troy ounce. Now don't forget to follow Trading Central on Twitter at Trading Central for all of your Forex market updates. And for Trading Central Web TV from the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Lelda Smith.